Yeah, that was quite a preview, Dan. More preview than a lot of people expected. The gates just opened a few minutes ago. This is going to be a spectacular and a beautiful show, we're told. The irony is that it came from such a tragic circumstance. Tonight, an opportunity for all of these people to give back. Depending on your level of hardcoreness, it's entirely possible that you missed out on lots of live music at AT&T early today. For this crowd outside right field looking in on Dave Matthews, sound checks count. It is like a free concert. This is unbelievable to be able to watch sound check like this. Long before tonight's five-hour benefit concert for North Bay fire victims, these were still the best seats in the house as technicians fine-tuned a sound system designed to eliminate echoes, focus that sound, and enhance clarity. The staff at VER um, have um, acoustical analysis uh, products mm. that allow them to look at gain, to look at the spectrum, uh, and to look at reflections, uh, and to calculate those. If you're wondering about the best seats in the house, right here, filled with first responders, people who lost their homes, volunteers. 6,000 people. Right there. Right, right, right in front. Marissa Geller works for Tipping Point, the Bay Area nonprofit that pulled this together. With at least 38,000 tickets sold so far, plus live streaming on both Facebook and Twitter, they hope to raise millions. Directly to Tipping Point, we give that directly to organizations on the ground working with low-income communities, so the people who are really hit hardest by the fires. So clearly this was more than just a sound check. Call it a help your neighbor check. At AT&T Park, Wayne Friedman, ABC7 News.